Hello YouTube, my name is Harshan and welcome to Let's Play Dead Space 3. I was gonna do a video for um, Rainbow Six Operation Outbreak, but the Rainbow Six servers have just been messing up all day today, been disconnecting a lot, not been getting challenges done, and loading in the matches without being able to move or do anything, so it's been it's been too buggy and I'm still in a zombie mood. So Dead Space seems to cover that bill. I'm doing New Game Plus, so it's going to be kind of easy. Okay, it should still be New Game Plus. I'm just, I'm just going to skip this. Basically, it's three years after Dead Space 2, five years total, I think, after Dead Space 1. Rundown being... Uh, you play as a guy named Isaac, Isaac Clark, who goes on... who goes looking for his girlfriend on a mining ship that they lost contact with and the mining ships are called planet crackers they rip a planet apart and mine the entire thing they'll destroy a planet get all of its resources and the premises of it is there are these uh life forms called necromorphs which are made by a alien artifact called a marker this guy is not isaac hart And so the whole premise is trying to destroy the markers and stop the necromorphs. Alpha Niner, this is Whiskey 250. Serrano, do you read me? Tim! Oh, thank God! Did you find it? Yes, we found it. No, we didn't. Never mind. I hate the intro. I wish I could skip it. Made doing hardcore really annoying. I don't mind. Like, hardcore mode for this, if you die, you have to restart the whole game over. I was thinking about doing that, and honestly, seeing this reminds me why I didn't, you know, try doing it, like, when this game first came out, I think it was four years ago. I'm not going to worry about the collectible, but collectibles, if you backtrack, well, actually, I get a suit on the Should have been. Unless you don't get it back. Oh, never mind. There it is. Okay. Okay, Tim. You can do this. Guns not even loaded. You. You're a soldier, right? Huh. <laughs> right. Thank you, I'm tutorials. Sorry. Okay. Well, oh, I got ammo. Basically, you weren't supposed to have ammo. I don't know why I do. I think it's from. I don't know. But in uh, Dead Space 2, it's three years later, and the marker the marker drives people crazy after they're exposed to it for a long enough time, which causes people to kill each other, which makes more necromorphs. I don't have kinesis. <laughs> but it also, if someone is smart enough, it imprints a blueprint of how to make more markers, which will... Which will trick people into thinking it gives off limitless energy, but it will do the same thing. Make people go crazy and make more necromorphs. Oh, I gotta go. This is the first... Ow. These ones are new. These ones are correction exclusive to this game. Most of the time they're about half a meter long. I can't heal. Most of the time these things are uh really deformed looking. <gasps> no 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 go, 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 go. okay. On that right side. And the trick to Necromorphs is that, unlike most zombie games, you gotta shoot them in the head. These ones, you have to shoot in the arm. You gotta take off all their arms in order to be certain they're dead. Okay. 
make sure my my video is still going. And this is uh from two hundred years before the first game occurred. My impression outbreak got really boring though. There's only like three missions, they're like really minor left for dead seeming seeming uh, type missions where it's run, kill some zombies, uh, do a horde defense mode, endless waves, and it was okay at first, but it got really boring after a while. Oh, damn! Oh, back over. That's a needle. Come on. Ah, uh, Timothy. Okay. Got the forms. Form the uh, forms. Rainbow Six is kind of bad. I'm, so far, I'm not liking this new season. It's already been two days, and I can I can forgive some of the bugs, like not getting the uh, Ash Elite skin. I don't really use Ash anyway. And bugs are expected. Code is ridiculous. Messes up really easy. I don't like the operate pack, so. Fine young soldiers, every one of them. Like, the whole system is now you can only buy them, and you can't even directly buy the stuff. That you might get from them, and most of them's even just variations of the same thing. Well, he said I should take this into the city. He said there's still time to stop it, sir. There's still time. We lost control. And now, for the love of Earth and the sovereign colonies, we've got to do what's right. You love the Earth. This game's really violent, by the way. Just, <laughs> just saying. Right, Tim. Glad to hear that. Uh, and that doesn't help anything. It's it doesn't help. I mean, we just make more dead bodies. Also about the markers, but yeah, it uh, turns dead bodies into monsters, and those go off, kill more things, and make more monsters. And eventually, after a while, it uh, if enough necromorphs are created, okay. okay, he is something called a unitologist, which thinks that the markers are a divinity. Thing they 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 have a whole religion worshiping them. Isaac, I know you're there. Come on, pick up the phone. Fine. Look, I just called to say I'm moving on. I have to. Just take care of yourself. Yeah. Okay. That's Ellie from she. You meet her in the second game. She's yeah. Trusty plasma cutter, tried and true. <clears throat> yes, it's me. As you can tell by my crazy drawings. I don't have a lot of time, so I want to make this brief. I understand you're something of an expert on markers. You created one. I didn't make shit. Your government made me. And you destroyed two, which is why we're here. Good job for you. Nice pajamas. You make them from men. I'm done with that. You find somebody else for your suicide mission. We did. Before we lost contact with her. She told us to find you. Ellie. Where is she? What'd you do to her? Where is she? 
Graphics really hold up for a five year game. Six years? I'm not sure. She's out there all alone, Isaac, and I can't help her unless you help me. Okay. Okay! Yep. Here. Get moving. Yeah, he, I, he, he was supposed to have grabbed a um, SMG. Since I'm playing New Game Plus, it has my own custom weapon, but it didn't really... There we go. Yes. Uh, okay. So basically, the Unitologists, they worship the Marker. And I'm not sure how many of them actually misunderstand its, um, its premise, because the religion also follows that believe in the Markers, you'll be brought back to life, and you'll eventually be made whole, which is what the markers do when there's enough necromorse. They do a thing called convergence, which just yeah, it's bad. Yeah, and Isaac is a very broken man by this point. He's been through two, like, hellhole okay. events. I said I'd help you. Now, where's Ellie? How long has she been missing? Just shut up and get over here. We'll play later. He's insane. He overcomes his insanity in the second game, but it's horrible. And now he's got the Unitologists, who pretty much think he's the Antichrist equivalent hey. for destroying the Markers. Who the hell are you guys? Earth Gov's last battalion. Name's Norton. Captain Robert Norton, Sergeant John Carver. Yep. Last battalion, what Hello. do you mean? Last means last, genius, as in no more left. Looks clear. No more left? Yeah. That doesn't make sense because the the Earth governments span across several different, like, thousand colonies. And even if I'm generous giving the Unitologists, like, say, maybe they're a third of the population, which is being generous sorry that's just not working i saw like supposedly i supposed to say that the government's been completely destroyed that guy was just an idiot even for unitology standards because if your body gets destroyed supposedly you can't be brought back and made whole so that was just dumb of him but i suppose suicide bombing is that's not what I wanted, but... Excuse me. Excuse me. That's a lot. Oh, hey. Yep. You! You! Get, get out of there! Shut your trap! And this game is a lot more actiony than the first two. I remember that caused a big stink on Reddit. And I can see both sides of the argument, but anyways. overall, I don't like it though. Why are these fanatics after you? destroyed markers in the past, Isaac. That makes you a direct threat to their plan. Plan? Some end time prophecy based on the markers. Convergence? Yeah, Ellie thinks you can stop her. No, that's all I have. So now she's missing and he follows you here? Yes, now get to the roof of the Dredger Corp building. There's an extraction team waiting. No, sorry if you can't hear that. Let's... Okay. Uh, that counts. Rendezvous with Norton. Okay, that was empty. Okay, that was empty. That's the first time it's ever happened. Not. Like, I'm okay with the humans. And couldn't heal her, and her rig is red. So. That's not a like about. Alright. Um, okay then. There we go. Wonky hitbox. Anyways. 
So I like about this game is like, you see the back of uh, Isaac? That's essentially your HUD. Like that, that uh, white bar going up and down is traffic. <laughs> that white bar is your health, and that blue bar is something called uh, stasis. Shit! I've hit the freeway. Then you'll you'll see what stasis does in a second. Transports. They don't stop for anything. I've still got my stasis unit. I'll slow the traffic and get across. Okay. And uh, yeah. Bop. And it's basically it's basically your HUD, and it's probably one of the most clever HUDs I've seen in any game, really. It, I'm not sure what the word is. What I like about it, it's integrated. I, I'm I'm not sure. Like it's not a, around the edges of the screen. It's like a part of the environment almost, which is pretty cool. You can tell I just were never really an enemy, quote unquote. Well, okay, never mind. There's one woman in uh, Dead Space, one named Kendra, and that's another one in Dead Space 2 named uh, Diana. And they both try to undermine you, try so they can try to get a marker. Well, Kendra tries to get. Alright. It's systematic slaughter. Oh, we have no too many. But why topple the government? Why Earth Gun? Danik blames them for experimenting with the markers. They took care of you. So you can imagine what they think of you. Have you reached the extraction site yet? I'm almost there. I'm not sure exactly where Danik started from, which is the guy in the white coat. Because this is. First appears in this, and there's no. I don't think there was any external material with him in it. I can't remember what I was saying before. But yeah, the Unitologists have always been like secondary antagonists in a way. And this is definitely a primary role. This one's still alive. Bring him here. Which I don't mind. In fact I was always kinda hoping at some point, but stuff like the cover system in this seems kinda tacked on. For. Oh, don't waste your energy. You're going to be dead in a matter of minutes. It's like Austin Powers. Like now that I think see. about it. There. You see that? That's a marker test lab. They're nice. everywhere at all the major colonies and out. Nice ponytail. <laughs> Short. God, never noticed that before. Program, Isaac, you help make them. And today, you of all people get to watch me set them free. No. No. You'll kill everyone. Death is only the beginning, Isaac. Nature must take its course, and I can't uh, allow you or anyone else to stop. Uh, whatever. Eyes forward, Isaac. Pay attention. Yeah, that building's totally not shaped like a marker, but anyways. Love that sound. Anyways. And that's the turn things into necromorphs signal. And that one sword kind of didn't react at all. <laughs> this is all pretty much the tutorial still. I'm sure there's a way to get that. Like, you eventually find uh, suits of armor. And I think that one's based on a suit of armor in Dead Space 2 called the Hacker Suit. Wearing a leather jacket. I wish there was a way to get that back, but with a helmet. Imagine Death Space. Death Space 2, it didn't have a helmet, but. Bonk. Nope. Ow. Ugh. Nope. You did not. Okay. Uh... Alright, was that necessary? Alright, that's cool. Oh, uh, could you not? Could you, could you really not? Uh, okay, whatever. I was trying to get an achievement, kill him with. 
their own weapons. Didn't work. Hello, darkness, my old friend. It's really hard to find stuff to talk about sometimes. That's the city, though. I'm not sure where this is, actually. Um. Might be Earth, actually. Can't tell. So I think we're I think we're on the moon. I'm not sure. That, I'm, that's probably Earth. The other ones were on some deep. St okay, you're dead. Yeah, you can pick stuff up and throw them back. And enemies in Dead Space One would drop their loot automatically. In Dead Space Two, though, it started to where you had to stomp on them, which I didn't mind. It was fun and gave me some time to just take my frustration out on one that almost killed me and made me waste my items, but... Sometimes though the bodies will despawn way too fast and I'm getting frame rate issues. That didn't happen last time. And that's probably why they despawn the bodies so they can avoid frame rate resource uh, depletion. Oh god. But it really sucks. Like in Death Space 2, there was a type of enemy that would run at you in packs, and every one of them would. I'll use my line gun. I ain't used it yet. Okay. Like, there was one enemy that would, like, run at you in packs, and there was, like, tens, twenties of them. But they would all. They basically use up all your ammo and despawn before you can get anything in return. It's really annoying. Some people, like I look up things on like uh, Steam or Reddit, and some people never actually had that issue. So I don't know what kind of system they're running on, but I'd want it. it would save me so much trouble for my hardcore run too. Alright, well, the gun was kind of fun, but now it's not. All dead. And it got here first. Oh, fuck. Then find a way out of the city. I'm coming in with the Eudora. Washington Station's not far. I can ride one of the trains out. Good plan. See you on the tracks. Bit of an audio delay desync on his lip movements. I don't understand how the Unitologists completely toppled Earth Gov. Now, as with several revolutions in actual history, don't underestimate the power of a few dedicated armed men. But even then, it's still like. And I, mean, I suppose being a large religion had its benefits that it also permeated the government and the military, so they probably could have taken some stuff like ships, weapons. I'm not sure what the mount of hey, I don't think and that's basically there was an achievement for destroying this. I don't think I can get it in this one. Yeah, no, nah, it's it's in the shot box so. Oh, lounge. Massage. Salvation is near service at one. Interesting. I, I like cityscapes like this. This is cool. Adds flavor to the world. Sadly, in a game that's supposed to be a horror series, I, it relied on claustrophobia. But. I rely a lot on being claustrophobic. It's very open in this one. I didn't think anything. I think they're all dead. Except for you. Ow! It's funny, I remember you were there right as you shot me. Um, 
Midnight Sun, a massive explosion of taste. Hype. Yes, help is on the way. Just hide. Oh, oh god. Um, you're not supposed to be here. Damn it. No trains. Yeah, there's plenty of trains. You just gotta okay. put it together. I made it to the train station. What about Danix, man? I lost some of the panic. This outbreak may buy us some time. Well, grab the train. Let's go. No good. Looks like the train was getting refitted with a new power car. So? I'm gonna have to put yeah, it back together. Yep. We'll do it fast. Danix gunships are far off. We'll try to draw them away then. Be fast. Working on it. It's not cooperating train too well. There we go. Incomplete. Please attach engine and fuel car before initiating departure sequence. Yep. And... Go. Got him. This place could probably have a good... This place, if done right, would probably be a good movie. Departure process initializing. Please board to the rear of the train. There was a lot of unnecessary backtrack. My movies don't have to worry about that. Okay, you're interrupting me. Why are you interrupting me? You can't miss it. It'll be the only thing moving. All right, understood. I'll close in once you clear the city. Be ready for pickup. This is going to be tricky. All right. You still haven't told me what happened to Ellie. Now's not the best time, Isaac. Is she alive? No, it's never the bad time. Last I saw her was a keyhole station. She said she was onto something big. Shocked out to some secret coordinates, and then we lost contact. I know your ex-girlfriend very well. She's still alive, and mad as hell we haven't found her yet. <laughs> Sounds like her. <laughs> Problem is Eudora is like huge. In the next level, you'll probably get an idea of how big it actually is. Like that's about the size of those gunships, and it's like inside of a glass tube, which makes me wonder if they just didn't think about the uh, scale. Ow! Which makes me wonder if they didn't think about the scaling size. Okay, this gun's supposed to be really accurate. I don't know what that was. And they're kind of, you know, being shot at right now. Should I use? Uh, no, I probably shouldn't. Oh, actually, you know what? Oh, rocket launch is really good in this. That's one thing I like about this game is the weapon crafting. I want to ask just a drop ship. Yep, good. Slowly reach for me. No. <sighs> then there was no glass tube and they go hyperspace. Of Carver. I'm sorry. Yeah. Don't be. We're not friends. Yeah. yeah. By the end of the game, they're magically Back friends with Back each other. Next time. Carver, time to go again. Yeah. Good. We're almost there. Get your asses to the bridge. Good, yes, sir, Captain, sir. Okay, it's about. And it's been about time. Okay, yeah. So this is. This is the Eudora, which is the ship that flew over the train. 
the sky, the uh, size scaling. Almost combined some words there. It was really off. But anyways, that's all I got for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think in the comments section, and uh, I'll see you next time.